Hey guys, and welcome back to another video here on cloudwords.net. And I recently published a video about Amazon Cloud Drive and how to store three terabytes of data. And I've gotten a lot of emails, a lot of feedback to the video. So thank you for that. And in this video, I wanted to do something different. I wanted to present a question a lot of you guys have, and that is how can you access files of a cloud storage service without having to sync them like accessing those files via a network drive because many of you have different cloud storage services or even multiple accounts with uh, several cloud storage services for example dropbox google drive copy sync or or other services so how can you make use of all of those um, services without needing to install the app and sync the files to your computer that may occupy a lot of hard drive space. But before I show you my solution, what I've been dabbling around with in the last couple of weeks, I just want to let you know that here on CloudWords on the YouTube channel, we almost, almost got 1000 subscribers and I'm very happy with that. I know I've been a little slow in uploading videos, but in future, I will be heavily uploading more content around the cloud and also other cloud related apps. So stay tuned and subscribe if you haven't already and also stay tuned for our thousand subscriber special video where we will have uh something very special for the subscribers and you can win something hint hint okay so now um let's go right into the solution i've been playing around with now for this scenario i'm using a software that is called expand drive uh, you can see here the icon right here or you can just look at their uh, website expanddrive.com it is a paid software but you can test it for free i believe it's not very expensive and the development team is very responsive they were so nice to give me a review copy so i just as a full disclosure i did not pay for the software however if you sign up for expand drive i do not get a kickback so there is no affiliate link it's just pure information and uh, i just wanted to share this solution with you so you can download the software here and then you install it on your mac or windows computer well, I believe they have it for one. Yeah, available for Windows. Okay, you can install it on a Mac and Windows. And let's now hop over to the right edge of my screen. Um, the beauty is that you can connect Google Drive or other cloud storage services uh, to your Expand Drive account. Now, for example, I have a copy account, and they once had a um, op option to invite people, and you could gain more storage. So I have 200 gigabytes of storage with um, with a copy and I can connect that and you can see here the little drive symbol and now it is connected to my drive and when I show you the finder you can actually see that copy.com is not a folder but it is a drive and I can see the contents of the drive here without having to sync the contents to my computer now i have the folder right here as well because i've installed copy before but in recent days i've been playing more and more with uh, the solution of embedding a drive so let's have a look at what kind of services you can actually add to expand drive now if you want to add a new service for example uh, dropbox let's add dropbox as an example so you click on the plus icon and you have a plethora of drives that you can add here so you have a dropbox you have one drive you can add other ftp services of course you can even add your own cloud service or um other um cloud related services you may be you may be using so when you add dropbox you just hit on the Dropbox icon, then you log into your Dropbox account. It will connect to the Dropbox API like so, and you just log in with your email and password and sign in, and then you can activate Dropbox as a drive in your computer without it having uh, occupying uh, precious disk space on your computer. So the beauty of this solution is, technically, you can connect multiple Google Drive accounts or multiple Dropbox account so you can even combine free storage. So if you have three or four Dropbox account with five gigabytes of data, that you can connect all those uh, accounts into the Drive Manager and then connect those drives here. So for example, I've added my Google Drive account, I can just hit play and then it will connect the drive of course i have to allow the connection to be uh to be available here 
And then it connects to your Google Drive, just like that. And uh, you can access your files, you can browse your files and view your files and even edit your files uh, via uh, the Drive uh, feature. So that's a pretty neat feature. I hope uh, this helps you a little bit with your free storage and with uh, your Google and Dropbox account and managing all of that. Of course, it's not the only solution out there, but this is just the one I've been playing around with in the last couple of days and I've been very happy with it. So stay tuned for my next video where we celebrate 1,000 subscribers and we have a special uh, for you. So you really need to watch this video. Hopefully you subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, I'll be more than happy to answer your questions just uh, write a comment below or email me at mauricio at cloudwords, C-L-O-U-D-W-A-R-D-S dot net. And I'll be happy to answer your question. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.